So I have already created my fill layer with the white color and I am on Pixel Studio. So this effect will work on layout, pixel and vector since we're going to use features that are present in all studios. So now let's select the artistic text tool, left click and then select artistic text tool. And now I'm going to left click and now I'm going to type my text. I'm just going to type text, control A to select all text. I'm going to change the font here to Anton. For the size, let's see, for 300. So I'm going to leave it to 300 and now I'm going to select the move tool and now I'm just going to center it. And now in order to create a vertical text, I am going to rotate this text first. So now let's select the transform panel here, left click if you don't have it, go to window, general, and then check the transform. As you can see for me, it is checked. And down here, the R here is the rotation and now I'm going to type minus 90 press enter so as you can see this will put the first letter on top and now make sure on the move tool right click on the text we're going to convert it into curves and now left click here convert to curves and now as you can see it changed the tool to the node tool now let's select the move tool again left click and then we are still on the transform here and now i'm going to open this group here so here are the curves here the letters here were changed to curves. I'm going to select the first one, the T. This one here, make sure on the move tool. I'm going to left click here, make sure the transform here is in the center. And now I'm going to bring back the rotation to zero. In the R here, double click and then type zero, press enter. So here it is. And now I'm going to select the E letter and then just bring back the rotation to zero, press enter. And then let's select the X here. Type the on the R here, type zero, and then select the T, double click on the R and then zero. And now in order to adjust the spacing between these letters here, we need to adjust the spacing between the first and the last letters. So for example, I'm going to bring this letter here down like this. And now let's select the first one, the first letter. I'm going to bring it here like this. And now, as you can see, I am still on the move tool. I'm just going to drag over all the letters. And then go to layer, arrange, align, and then here click space vertically. So here it is. Now let's say I'm going to left click here. I'm going to move this one here up. And then I'm going to move the bottom one like this. Just select them again. And then go to layer, arrange, align, and then space vertically. 